What's going on guys, it's Iron Player here and today I'm going to be showing you how to properly use the USR and L115 sniper rifles. I'm going to be going over a lot of things that people don't know about these sniper rifles. So if you didn't know, the USR and L115 within Ghost have a unique feature called the recoil compensator, meaning that every kill the view kick will be progressively reduced and so essentially the higher kill streak you get with these two sniper rifles, the more accurate the guns will behave. So a lot of people just know this and they will leave it that they don't think too much of about this feature but if you actually look at the top of these two sniper scopes you'll actually see an led screen with some information on it you might think this is just to look cool it's for effect like it normally is but these screens actually are the recoil compensators and they have some important information that you need to be always looking at so how it actually works as i mentioned the more kills you get the better the recoil will be and uh, so the recoil will be reduced progressively up until four kills so at zero kills the recoil will be at its standard it will be at its normal or default and then when you get one kill with it the recoil will be reduced slightly and then all the way up to four kills it will be its most accurate point and that's its max four kills and uh, in a second I'll do some side by side comparisons where you can see the differences that these compensators actually make between having zero kills and four kills so essentially what's important is that you pay attention to this screen as each four dots represent a kill and when you get a kill you'll see one of the dots turn into a skull and crossbow bones and it'll say 1x or 2x depending on how many kills you have often in game you'll have some kind of kills and deaths unless you're keeping count there's no real way to tell what kind of a kill streak you're on but this screen is really helpful if you pay attention to it and it'll always let you know what kind of a kill streak you're on up to four and it's a very good idea to keep an eye on this little screen and make sure you know what stage the recoil compensator is actually on and with the compensator it is like a kill streak thing when you die it will be reset back to zero so it's kind of like a progression kill streak with this compensator once you die it will go back to its default settings so uh, that's an important piece of information to take note of and uh, so here I have the USR sniper rifle aimed at the bottom of this stripe here and on the left we have the USR with no kills and on the right we have the USR that's gotten four kills so the compensator will have kicked in to its maximum point and uh, it will now be the most accurate it can be because this gun on the right now has four kills on it so if you look after the shot has been taken you'll see on the right as expected is a bit more accurate obviously it's not massively because this needs to be balanced uh, sniper rifles are powerful enough and you don't need the laser beam zero recoil snipers running around but uh, it does make a decent difference and uh, it's definitely noticeable because you can see that with no compensation the center of the crosshair jumps over the stripe into the next one and uh, with the compensator at its max after four kills it stays within the stripe and I'm not 100% certain but it does look like the compensator does all also improve the weapon's center speed which is the time taken for the crosshairs to return back to the default position after the kick has gone off it's not a huge improvement but it does return faster and it's definitely uh, better than without any kills and we see a similar story here on the L115 because uh, naturally the L115 is a bit more recoil than USR so it rises a little bit higher but they uh, both rise into the next band but the one on the right with the recoil compensator has kicked in lower whereas the left is a lot higher so hopefully this video has helped you out and shown you something you didn't know before if it did and you found it helpful then feel free to give it a thumbs up like rating and for more videos feel free to subscribe to my channel so i hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys later Jump.